hello everyone and welcome back to another video and in this video today we will analyze quickly analyze the civil service 2020 mains paper that has been conducted today that means 17th january 2021 okay today i'm recording this video okay and this paper has been conducted today itself okay so if i give quickly analysis so those who are preparing for civil service exam as a mechanical engineering optional okay dedicatively civil service exam so they will give their time majority in gs portion okay sa and all other thing they will give time here also but those who are preparing for gate and engineering service exam so they will find this paper very easy compared to those aspirants okay why because something here uh, that is miller indices and some uh, uh, industrial management questions are there and material science questions are there uh, so some uh, aspirants uh, might not have studied okay so let us quickly analyze both the paper one and two so let us start with section a of paper one so there is one basic mechanics question that is two equation question that is initially uniform acceleration and then constant velocity so that is thing and here you have to find the ten tensile force okay uh, basically a tower is there and one rod is attached so we have to find this okay the tension in the force and this is not 2d this is 3d truss okay so you can solve by coplanar non-concurrent and here the five bar chain and prove we have to put this is an unconstant chain why this is one no not any constant motion here and there and those who have studied theory of machine very well okay now here it is in this next question it is given that we have to show that this is not a kinematic chain again okay this is unconstrained chain and this is not a kinematic chain because mobility is not there if this uh, a b f and b e c okay here degree of freedom a truss like system like uh, if the number of joints and number of variables are the redundant structure okay this this kind of if this three these two triangles a b f and b e c you are seeing if they are rigid they are not individual if, if they are welded together and behave like a one so then it will become a kinematic chain next whirling speed of shaft find the deflection and critical thing this is very easy one of the very easiest question of strength of material from principal stresses and strain just put the all the formulas you will get all the values your or if you want to go for more stress more circle then again also good here the some gear design question two questions are there then we have to find moment of inertia then shear force bending moment diagram very easy and then uh, one question from porter governor also and there uh, all the arms link and rotation radius of rotation order all are given so for here we have to find a and b that constant and what is the mass all this given and we have to find the equilibrium speed at a particular rotation radius of rotation okay and here friction force is also we have to consider okay so don't forget it then the mirror indices are given so we have to draw the crystallographic plane the reverse process just next uh, pressure vessel cylindrical shell internal pressure diameter all the diameters are given we have to find pressure exerted by the fluid on the cylinder so just what are the fluid pressure based on fluid mechanics theorem and hope stress that is circumferential stress that is pd by 2t because this is a cylindrical stress cylindrical shell so that this is the very easy and this is the balancing we have to there are two unbalanced masses at a and d there are and the radius is given at which radius from the shaft they are located we have to find the location of this intermediate so just make this plane a as a reference plane and starting start taking zero from here so one force is automatically get zero so that is easy for balancing then there is a classifier the nanomaterial based on the number of dimensions okay what are the corresponding structures so that you can uh, those who have not studied material science that they will not understand and those who have studied they have attempted very well and this question of uh, section b question 5a what do you term in term a flash and in the forging and why would what is the help of sketch okay the flash that is the extra material in the when we are forging out so after the material that that is getting out from the uh, main object okay that is called flash okay and after that flash there is a gutter okay 
the excess metal is went in the gutter okay and if the the excess metal is not uh, very much then it will be around a flesh like a small thin okay thin metal sheet and by trimming process we are removing this flesh okay then this question question number 5b this question is a copy paste of previous year civil service question okay without any data change again repetitive question then this is the to tell us to life equation v, vt power n is, n is equal to c in this question what you have to do vt power n is equal to c there are two times and two velocity so take the log, log on the both sides so two equation two unknown you can find uh, n and c value and based after finding this value uh, you can find uh, the two life at uh, this 120 rpm okay then there are what are the various types of plant layout and product layout and process layout they are very easy just product is a, all the machine are arranged on the based on the product operation and process all the similar kind of process are, are arranged together then this is industrial management break even analysis very easy and then this question of metal cutting in orthogonal turning what are the data is given here and the similar kind of question i have solved in my previous video just go and check out their name the, of the videos that is rcfl management training exam analysis okay because in that the analysis was very short and in that video i also solved one question that has been sent by one viewer in telegram group okay and where the most of we most of us uh, we do the mistakes okay i also marked out there so just go and watch the video okay and this more or less similar kind of data is there and just chip reduction coefficient this thing you have to keep in mind what is this what is this one to say next this a component that is made okay center lathe turret lathe it's a similar kind of question but there is not turret lathe only single lathe and but uh, here the processing time that we are changing so similar kind of question that has been asked in engineering service means this year okay i have solved that problem also and this is the regression analysis one only two equation just do the multiplication and addition you will find this and this is a wire drawing this is the one of the good question if you know the wire drawing equation because they are very hectic to <laughs> remember so if you know the answer if you remember the equation then you can attempt very well then these are the enlist the basic elements of just in time and kanban and in brief so these are the new newly added topic in gate exam okay so those who are studying so they know what is just in time what is zero inventory what is kanban okay continuous improvement all this thing and this is based on uh, annual there is inventory again from industry okay so this is very basic there is no any shortage okay and no any so there is no any shortage but that is con continuously production and consumption model okay pc model and here the ultrasonic machine okay so what is the time if we change from ultrasonic machining to uh, wire cut okay so this is okay so this kind of question if you study the theory well well that is the uh, in ultrasonic machining the we can use generally brittle material okay we cannot use the ductile material if you use the other material then we can use also ductile material also the material removal rate is increased surface finish may or may not be affected okay that are the points that you can write down here advantages and limitation of lean manufacturing that is again part of just in time kanban kaizen 5s6 sigma so those who have these are all are one chapter okay those if you know understand that is only five to six points are there advantages and limitation and those who are experienced person so they can write very easily without even even any studying okay so this is about paper one next this is paper two thermal part so again this is again very easy one question this is first from a steady flow analysis and again this is basic thermodynamic heat gen sorry heat transfer with internal heat generation okay so there is internal heat generated and one side temperature surface is given and we have to find at three different location and and general relations also we have to obtain again very good this question uh, c derive an appropriate equation and show that divergent duct as a 
supersonic nozzle okay so this is fluid dynamics or you can say that full compressible flow so those who have studied compressible flow they can very easily derive there is only three to four step derivation okay that is a uh, in supersonic flow divergent portion work as a nozzle okay this question d this is a repetition of the question that has been asked in esc 2019 means this is the first question of that question paper okay next is what are the reheating of the steam turbine in Rankine cycle very easy and what are the effect of reheating so those who have studied very well okay not only numerical point of view but theoretical point of view they can uh, do the easily that's why i already told you so those who are preparing for engineering service and gate they will find very easily okay because as i got this paper and i think 75% uh, of paper i have solved within two and a half hour 75% means this paper one and this paper two now i'm not taking account the theories okay so whatever theory just solve the numerical in uh, just by putting equation and values and doing doing the calculations necessary okay and here one thing that is a boy we have to find the boiling rate this is the modification of previous questions if you see the civil service paper 2016 17 okay so there is one same question boiling of liquid nitrogen is there and uh, but there is only one thing that is it is not insulated here there are three cases in not insulated insulated with 5 mm thickness with fiberglass and in third case the thickness is less but the thermal conductivity is very less so what is the effect that is the we have to see okay and here uh, nozzle steam nozzle similar kind of problem that we are uh, doing in the our steam turbine but the here the principles of we are going to use is steam nozzle and here again next uh, air compressor problem the actual this is basically actually we can say the thermodynamic work minimum work actual work irreversibility okay next is single stage uh, blade rings and uh, reaction fl actual flow steam turbine okay so this is basic problem of steam turbine okay just we have to find the uv draw the velocity diagram and please keep in the mind the angles okay 50 percent reaction turbine okay parsons turbine we can say so this is the hint i am giving you so this is 50 percent reaction axial flow turbine steam turbine okay so this is the hint So that is first law, second law, and Carnot efficiency relation. Very easy. That is uh, this this question. Uh, I am highlighting the question that is that has been asked in FSC JE. Okay, and same for fifteen marks. Then this question C. Velocity profile and this is very easy. We have to take the um, velocity of and drag force. Okay this question question 4a that is spring similar kind of question that has been asked in gate 2020 exam but there is some modification in spring length okay and uh, the thing is that the amount of heat that is supplied is it is directly given to us but here it is a uh, initially evacuated uh, pipeline is connected and the gas is entering okay so whatever the gas is entering so after the final temperature and what is the initial temperature of this volume this cylindrical volume okay so we have to take the difference and multiply with specific heat so that will give amount of heat so one more step additional step that is in gate exam the spring is not fully that is only up to half length and the amount of heat is it is directly given here we have to do the one step more okay next is the heat exchanger again using n method you can do very easily and here centrifugal fans for backward curved blade velocity diagram we have to draw just and what are the draughts are used in centrifugal plant steam power plant that is very easy okay and uh, give the comparative statements of the steam various factor desired high or low tend to reduce the knock in assigned ca engine so we have to list down the parameters that is if we increase the turbulence then uh, it will decrease the your uh, knocking effect again i have explained you very well in my previous video okay this question i have solved next this is operating temperature that is simple vcr cycle okay 
if you see the data then all the temperatures again find the cop and this uh, what is the heat rejection ratio okay and again there is a an inventor claim that he is producing some uh, more better than this okay but we have to justify that whether this claim is uh, correct or wrong then axial flow fan operate that the same funder for axial flow compressor then this is the derivation for area ratio of in compressible flow this is the basic again derivation of fluid dynamics this is the initial derivation from this all the things started then uh, explain the basic reason why capillary tube is used so that is very easy sasta simple tick out okay one line answer not to this is one line answer but you have to elaborate something next is an oil engine working on the standard cycle that means oil engine that means a auto cycle but it is working on dual cycle and this question has been asked in indian forest service exam and this is one food storage chamber all these things are 12 given refrigerant and you have to find the cop and all that thing i think at the similar kind of question i have covered not 12 ton that is capacity i think there is only 10 ton capacity the only numeric value change is here and this is again the rotor and stator blade again 50 percent reaction turbine that is parsons turbine so you those so you, you know the theory or basic around this basics of this just static temperature increases static pressure decreases technician temperature increases technician pressure decreases just do the one line answers and get the 10 marks very good and this question 39.6 meter cube per minute of mixture of air okay this question has been asked in indian forest service last to last year 2018 paper okay so this is just repetition of this and again this is a critical mac number and in normal shock wave okay so this is again one where there are very basic questions are there okay so those who are preparing for ESC and get they will find very easy but don't worry and again this is a gas turbine plant but here the term is isentropic efficiency is added so we have to do one more steps in calculation okay so nothing to worry about it then this is six stroke six cylinder four stroke efficiency specific fuel consumption and this is the similar kind of the question that has been asked in engineering service examination 2017-18 okay and what are the environment and safety operation of idle refrigerant so you have to write the your environment uh, properties of refrigerant like it should be easily uh, detectable and it should not be if there is a leakage then it should not damage the ozone layer potential global warming potential it should be as low as possible okay so these are some points that you have to write so this is the all about today's video all the analysis so in short in a nutshell if i want to tell then paper is a scoring okay so thank you for watching this video hope you enjoyed this